Cheers. Uh, greetings, true believers. Uh, Gundam Jeffrey Kai here, answering the call for videos, video tours of people's rooms. Uh, so, without further ado, let's get on with it. Okay, the room's a little bit messy at the moment uh, for reasons you're about to find out. Uh, this stuff here actually is just messy anyway. Uh, those boxes are all just um, basically where I store my uh, DVDs and mangas. So basically they're just filled with um, old volumes which I've just um, trying to tidy up away. Uh, over here we have my Kendo Shinai bag uh, for my um, club, Toilet Kendo. Okay, and next to it we have one Shinai which I was basically just um, re redoing. Okay. Down here we have uh, just basically a bedside drawer, and we've got uh, my PSP and iPhone standing next to uh, Squishy Cartman, and a uh, copy, copy of Volume 1 of uh, Nagasarate Island Tour. Uh, I'm not entirely sure why Volume 1 is here, but um, it's all in Japanese. Uh, so I bought it because just wanted a bit of practice um, just remembering all the um, hiragana and katakana. Um, it's a good thing because um, even though there's kanji in the, um, Iranto. There's also the Furigana uh, next to it, so I'm still able to read it. Okay, uh, just looking around. Uh, just my bags. Um, this here's a, just a whole pile of uh, mangas which I've um, read recently. Um, I'm pretty lazy in that respect, so this uh, bit I just end up reading my mangas and then just putting them into a pile. And then once the pile once the pile reaches a certain height, then I store them away. Uh, kind of think of it. Looks like it's about time to actually start storing anyway. So we've got some. Jojo here, um, XL Saga, uh, Lucky Star, I'm not entirely sure why I've got Lucky Star, but, um, and here we have my Autocool book, um, signed by Danny Chu uh, when he was over in London, uh, got a Danny business card as well, um, I'm in um, Autocool somewhere, can't remember what page exactly, but um, feel free to try and find me, and lying down on my bed at the moment, we have my Kendo Bogu, okay, I uh, just received this today actually, I'm um, just spending a bit of time trying to break the down, break it down and um, just make it a little bit usable. Uh, there's my door um, for protecting my um, body, uh, the men for the head and the door tare um, with my little name tag there saying um, who I am and um, which door I'm in. Uh, for those um, who don't know, uh, that kanji is um, the kanji for Tora, um, for Tiger, which is the name of my um, kendo dojo. Okay, looking around. Uh, Wardrobe full of clothes, uh, not too clean there. Loads of boxes and okay, over here. Let me bring it down. We have my limited edition PS2 Resident Evil 4 chainsaw controller. Uh, thought it looked really cool when I, um, the game came out, so I bought it along with the game um, many years ago. Uh, unfortunately, I never actually used it uh, because it makes the game impossible to play because the controller is just well, it's just awful, to be honest. Uh, it makes the game really, really hard, and um, it's just really difficult and painful to move around with. So it's basically just been hanging around here since then. Okay, Rock Band, fantastic game. I uh, recommend um, playing with some mates if you haven't. Okay, down there's my um, Rock Band drum kit. Okay, more Rock Band boxes, and over here is my infamous to-do pile. It's basically um, all the model kits which I've purchased but have yet to actually build. Uh, on the top here is actually just an empty box. Um, that's where I, that's what I use to spray the primer onto the um, kits before they're ready to paint. Okay, uh, kit-wise we have um, the VF25 um, Alto version with um, Sharon Lim decals, um, which needs um, some work on eventually. Gundamexia and uh, Infinite Justice. Okay, over here we have some of the garage kits which I've got waiting to be built. Uh, this one here is um, Tri-GK Sabre um, from Volks. And above it we have uh, Tri-GK Yoko. And next to them, hit down here, is one of my Grail kits. The Five Star Stories Knight of Gold with Buster Launcher. It's one of my favourite kits, especially the Five Star Stories. Uh, bought it um, end of last year when it was when it was re-released. Um, not sure when I'm going to get around to building that, but uh, look forward to it immensely. And in this box here is just basically a collection of um, some garage kits which I've bought over the years, along with um, 
bases and a few other extra parts and whatnot. Uh, having a quick look, we've got uh, we've got Fate T Halon from Nanaha Strikers and uh, Isaka Tiger um, Toradora. Okay, so eventually those um, two will be built. Okay, looking over here, we've got um, my ever-growing pile of PVC figures. Uh, most of these are still in their boxes because I'm actually running out of space to put them all. Uh, got the Emotion Style Shower Gnome, uh, Shower Gnome Noah's Art version, and Sable Lily. And down the bottom we have um, Fate T. Halon from uh, Volks, um, the Altice and um, model kit over there as well, and a couple of Figmas. And sitting on the top here is my uh, Shower Gnome action figure um, from Mega House. Okay, and next to her, there's uh, my Bioshock 2 Special Edition. Uh, the reason it's uh, the box is actually that big is because the soundtrack, which was released um, with it, uh, came on vinyl, um, which is actually um, the format for music which predates cassette tapes. So that's why it's massive over there. Uh, got my two rock band guitars here uh, for when I'm playing with some mates. Okay, uh, more Figma boxes. Okay, and over here we have my um, Mecha collection. Okay, we've got some Armored Core here, some Gundam stuff at the back, uh, Revoltech Dangayo, uh, my favourite Mecha design ever, uh, Pat Labour, uh, Master Grade units um, from Gundam Seed Destiny, and three Super Rebel Wars kits with uh, Code, uh, Lancelot from Code Geass hiding in the back there. Okay, going on to the next shelf, uh, we have, if we can just focus, there we go, we have the Alter um, Cosmos version 1 from Xenosaga, uh, probably my favourite um, Cosmos figure out of them all, except maybe the um, version 4 from Volks, which was released at um, end of last year. Uh, we've got Fuka and um, Revoltech Yotsuba, uh, Revoltech um, Ray and Asuka. Again, uh, more of Altex here, uh, of Sabre and Sabre Alter. I'm standing in front of the Alter 